who chose the Blessed Virgin Mary foremost among the poor and humble to be the mother of the Savior. And we pray that following her example, we may offer you the whole nation of sincere faith and placing you all of the hope of salvation. To our Lord Jesus Christ, our Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the book of the prophet Malachi. Thus says the Lord God, Lo, I am sending my messenger to prepare the way before me. And suddenly there will come to the temple the Lord whom you seek, and the messenger of the covenant whom you desire. Yes, he is coming, says the Lord of hosts. But who will endure the day of his coming? And who can stand when he appears? For he is like the refiner's wife, or like the fuller's life. He will seek refining and purify the silver, and he will purify the sons of Levi, refining them like gold or like silver that may offer due sacrifice to the Lord. Then the sacrifice of Judah and Jerusalem will please the Lord, as in days of old, as in years gone by. Lo, I will send you Elijah, the prophet, before the day of the Lord comes, the great and terrible day, to turn the hearts of the fathers to their children, and the hearts of the children to their fathers lest I come and strike the land with you. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Lift up your hands and see, your redemption is near at hand. Lift up your heads and see, your redemption is near at hand. Your ways, O Lord, make known to me. Teach me your path. Guide me in your truth and teach me, for you are God, my Savior. Lift up your heads and see, your redemption is near at hand. Good and upright is the Lord. Thus he shows sinners the way. He guides the humble to justice. He teaches the humble his way. Lift up your heads and see, your redemption is near at hand. All the paths of the Lord are kindness and constancy. The word to those who keep His covenant and His decrees. The friendship of the Lord is with those who fear Him and His covenant for their instruction. Lift up our heads and see, your redemption is near at hand. Her name was relatives heard 
that the Lord had shown his great mercy toward her, and they rejoiced with her. When they came on the eighth day to circumcise the child, they were going to call him Zechariah after his father. But his mother said in reply, No, he will be called John. But they answered her, There is no one among your relatives who has this name. So they made signs, asking his father what he wished him to be called. He asked for a tablet and wrote, John is his name. And all were amazed. Immediately, his mouth was open, his tongue free, and his spoke, blessing God. Then fear came upon all their neighbors, and all these matters were discussed throughout the hill country of Judea. All who heard these things took them to heart, saying, What then will this child be? For surely the hand of the Lord was with him. When Jesus Christ Good morning, brothers and sisters. Magandang umaga po sa mga pamilya na nanonood sa kanilang tahanan ngayon. Mga kapatid, sa nagdaang araw na ito, nabulagin tayo sa isang karumal-dumal na krimen na nabuhanan ng video at sa ibang social media o sa Facebook. Kaya nga, sa Facebook, hindi lamang trending yung video, kahit ang gadget ng NSN. At ano nga ba meron sa video ito? Dahil sa anita ng at hindi pagkakakulawaan, dalawang tao ang pinagbigan ng buhay. Isang nanay at isang nanay. At nakakatulong po ng puso na makita ang nanay na buong higpit na niyayapang ang kanyang anak para i-protectahan sa abusalong pulis. Buong tapang niya hinarap ang pinigo sa kanilang buhay sa pamamagitan ng mahigpit na yapang sa kanyang anak. At hanggang sa huli, Hanggang sa huli na kanyang hininga, ipinaglaban niya, prinotektahan niya ang kanyang anak sa pumamagitan ng kanyang maniging na yaka. Dito makikita natin ang kanakinaan ng isang magulaw na isang ina na handap sa krimisyo, handang inalay kami ng kanyang hininga para sa kanyang anak sa pumamagitan ng isang maniging na yaka. My dear friends, in our gospel today, we heard about the naming of John. And in this story, at first, there was a commotion because their neighbors and relatives were too curious and suggested they give him another name. Masasabi natin, sadyang pakiala meron kung si Zero ang kanyang mga kapitbahay at kamag-ana na kahit ang pangalan ng bata, pinakili niya laman. But Elizabeth and Zechariah decided to name him John, whom they considered as a special gift from God at their old age. Alam naman po natin yung kwento ng magkasawang ito. Sa matagal na panahon, ito ang kanilang hinilig, ito ang kanilang hinilay, ito ang kanilang pinagdasalan. Sa matagal na panahon, ito ang kanilang pinakawakan at niyakap na pangarap sa kanilang buhay at na magkaroon ng Totoo ba? Sa gitna ng kanilang katandaan at kapansanan, sa hindi inaasahang pagkakataon, kumalaw ng buspusan at krasya ng Diyos sa kanilang buhay dahil sila inubos na kinakabakan at kinaawaan ng Diyos. John was the greatest gift that they received from God, reminding them of God's mercy and compassion. Kaya kung paano sa kanila, ganun yung espesyal ng bata. Ganun kahalaga para sa kanilang sangkul na ito. At marami bilang mga magulang, ganun na lang din ang higpit na kanilang yapa sa pangangalagat sa sangkul na kahit ang pangalan o resistahan at pinaglaban nila maging buwan. Bilang pagtanaw ng utang na loob at pasasalamat sa kabukian loob ng Diyos sa kanila. Sabi nga, ganun naman talaga pag may pahalang mga magulang. Gagawin ang lahat para sa kanya Dear friends, it is said that before we embraced our independence and life, we were then dependent on the loving embrace of 
of our parents. Lahat tayo lumaki sa magiging tayaga ng ating mga magiging. Lahat tayo pinunan ng magiging And just like Zechariah, our parents also expressed their faith benedictus to God and thanks to Him for the gift of life entrusted to them here. Marahi, nung tayo ay hindihayat ang ating mga 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 Marahin sa puno ng buhay natin ngayon, marahin sa atin sa buhay natin. Nakamta na natin, narating na natin ang mga pinapangarap natin sa ating buhay. Pero hindi sa lahat sana, sa pag-alang natin sa ating buhay, huwag natin makalimutan na bawal na karoon ng pagulungan at direksyon ng ating pagkatao. May mga magbuka na unang nakalagal ito. Ang ating pangalan, ang ating pagkatao, unang nakupo sa mahigpit na yakap ng ating mga magulang. At alam natin, walang papantay sa mahigpit na yakap ng magulang na punong-puno ng pagmamahal para sa atin. Kahit saan man tayo dalhin ng pangarap natin sa ating buhay, at saan mong katanggo narating natin sa ating buhay, at yan na din, hahanapin pa rin natin. Mabalikan pa rin natin. From day one of our Simon Cafe, we encounter different stories and faces of parents in our meetings. We're entrusted by God with countless blessings, especially with the gift of life. At sa bawat biyayan ng buhay, ito ay kanilang tinalagaan, pre-detectan sa kanilang mayigit na yakap ng pagpamahal at masasalamat sa Diyos. Kagaya ang pinahing isa ben at si Kalias sa ating ibang bin. Babalikan natin pagbasa at sa walong araw na ito hindi mawawala ang kwento ng bawat pagkula at sa gitna ng bawat kwento ito ay ang nalang pagkula ng Diyos sa kanila ang pagpapala ng Diyos sa kanila as I said Christmas never complete without the stories of parents without the men the image of parents kaya na makikita natin sa
at sa'ng mga pabawin ang tako sa ating puso ay ang mahigpit na yakap ng mga Sana sa bawat pangungulina ng isang mga mula, meron din anak na katalim makap ng mahigpit sa kanila. Ngayon pas mo. Mga kapatid, kumabalik ka
has endorsed the acceptable to all the Almighty God. We the Lord accept the sacrifice of your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. Accept, O Lord, these offerings, and by your power, change them to this, into the sacrament of salvation, in which fulfilling the sacrifices of the fathers is offered the true land, Jesus Christ, your Son, Lord of the ever Virgin Mary, in a way beyond all heavy, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And be your spirit. Lift up your heart. We lift them up to the Lord. And give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just of our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord. Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, we Christ our Lord, for all the oracles and the prophets for whom Him, the Virgin Mother, long for Him with love beyond all pain. John the Baptist sang of His coming and proclaimed His presence when He came. It is by His gift that we're ready to rejoice at the mystery of His nativity, so that He may find us much for in prayer and exalted in His praise. And so with angels and archangels, thrones and dominions, and with all hosts and powers of heaven, to sing the name of your glory, as without end, we have made. Jesus Christ. 
to him and with him and in him, O God Almighty God. In the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. And dear friends, behold the Lamb of God, behold Him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
church, O Lord, that strengthened with the power of the sacrament, she may eagerly walk in the pathways of the gospel until she reaches the blessed bishop of peace, which the Virgin Mary, your lowly handmaid, already enjoys eternity in glory. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please all kneel for the oration in the God, our Father, we come to you in our need to ask for protection against the COVID-19 that has disturbed and even clean lives. We pray that you guide the people tasked to find cures for this disease and to spread its transmission. Protect the medical experts that they may minister to the sick with confidence and compassion. We pray for those afflicted. We may be restored to health soon. Protect those who care for them. Grant eternal rest to those who have died. Give us the grace in this trying time to work for the good of all and to help those in need. We implore you to stop the spread of this virus and to save us from our fears. Grant all this for our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. We fly to your protection, O Holy Mother of God. Do not despise our petition in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers. O glorious and blessed Virgin, Amen. Our Lady, Help of the Sea, Saint Raphael Archangel, Saint Rome, Saint Lorenzo Luis, Saint Pedro Alonso, Prayer for the Pontuian family. Let us pray. Jesus, Son of God, and Son of Mary and Joseph, bless these families. Graciously inspire in them the unity, peace, and mutual love that you have in your own family, in the little town of Nazareth. Mary, Mother of Jesus, and our Mother, nourish them with your faith and your love. Keep them close to your Son, Jesus, in all their sorrows and joys. Joseph, foster father to Jesus, guardian and spouse of Mary, Keep them safe from harm. Help them in all times of discouragements or anxieties. Holy family Nazareth, make them one with you. Help them to be instruments of peace. Grant them love, strengthen by grace, and be true mightier than all the weaknesses and trials through which all families sometimes pass. May they always have God at the center of their hearts and homes until they are all one family, happy and at peace in our true home with you. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. May God, who through the child bearing the Blessed Virgin Mary, will in his way kindness to redeem the human race. Amen. May you know all the, always and everywhere the protection of her, who whom you have been found worthy to receive the altar of life. Amen. May you, who have been out gathered in this day, Share always with you the gifts of spiritual choice and heavenly reward. Amen. And may the Almighty God bless you. Amen. Amen. The Holy Spirit. Amen. Go from the name of the news. Thanks be to God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank